love bubble wrap because I love bubble wrap. I just want to like, like I could do this for days. Okay, focus, focus. The bottle escapades, escape. That's like in Finding Nemo where she's like, escape, escape, and it's actually escape, but I actually don't know what this word is. Hey guys, it's Jay, and today I'm here with a very exciting unboxing. I was contacted by D.E. Knight and her publication team, and they asked me if I wanted to unbox this box. And of course I said yes, because your girl loves unboxings, and I was very excited about this one. So, without further ado, let us get started! So first off, can we just take in how gorgeous this packaging is? I'm kind of annoyed because they posted like this huge sticker on the top saying my address and whatnot, but like I kind of wanted to keep this box just because it's super pretty. But whatever, it's fine, I'll pretend that I'm not heartbroken about it. But let us open the box. Ooh, ooh. Okay, can we just take in the packaging first off because like, so cute? So the first thing I see in my little box is a card that says this magical box was personally created and boxed just for you by D.E. Knight. And I kind of want to keep this just because it's pretty. <laughs> Not gonna lie, probably gonna go on my shelf. So as I said, I love the packaging of this right now. I think it's super cute. It's like a little newspaper, tissue paper. Like, hello, yes, please. So cute. The next thing I see is this ball thing, which I'm gonna unwrap and let you know what it is. How do you get into this? How do you... I'm like scared. I'm just like... It across the, room. the next thing that was in the box was this little magic potion bottle, which is really cute and really sparkly, and I match it, so I'm happy about it. I'm assuming it has something to do with the book, not 100% sure, but definitely going up on the shelf. Might have to go on that shelf, because like this one's kind of full now. I'll figure out where to put it, but like super cute. Oh, it tells me what the bottle is. It says, a vessel full of charmed spring water invented by dwarves as a tool to develop and practice magical skills within the supposedly safe confines of imagined space. The glowing viscous water magnifies magic and enables mythical scenarios concocted by the bottle's owner. The bottle's escape Capades and dramas are shaped by the owner's thoughts and only limited by his or her imagination. Popularized by Professor Philbert Phoenix, I like that name, at the Halls of Ivy, Glanagiri bottles are now widely recognized as a powerful teaching tool. However, the inherent danger of the bottles must not be underestimated. Ooh, so like it's a magic potion bottle that does things. I'm assuming I'm gonna find out more when I read the book. Apparently this is supposed to light up, but I don't think that mine does. Mine definitely does not light up. But it's supposed to light up. That's okay. Unless I'm wrong. <gasps> Mine totally lights up. I'm so happy right now. <laughs> this is so cool. And then you can turn it off. Oh, God. I'm so excited. I'm so excited right now. Okay, guys. I have a glowing potion. <sighs> okay, definitely going on my shelf now. Probably not going to, like, turn it on all the time. But, like, I'm so excited about this. Okay, it's going to sit there for now until I'm ready to continue with my exploring. The book that was in the box is called The Crowns of Crosswald, and this is by D.E. Knight. This is the first book in a middle grade series which follows a girl named Ivy Lovely who lives on the outskirts of a magical border which separates the mundane from people with magical abilities, so when she crosses over this boundary, her powers awaken. She ends up attending a school called Halls of Ivy, which helps their students master their magical blood and abilities. When Ivy's magic begins to be threatened by the Dark Queen, she has to uncover the secrets of Crosswald before it is too late and her life becomes even more in danger. I think the book sounds really interesting and I want to say thank you to D.E. Knight and her publicist for sending me this box. It was so cool and I'm very excited to get into it. So thank you again and thank you for this magical glowing potion because I am way too excited about it. Alright guys, so that was my unboxing of the D.E. Knight box, I guess I can call it, or like the Crowns of Crosswald box. Thank you again to D.E. Knight and her publicist. I already said that like 20 times, but thank you, thank you, thank you. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.